Welcome back, Pickles, to another Sid's Corner. Thank you for sitting and tuning in with me. Um, I have this terrible crick in my neck. I must have been sleeping wrong a couple of days ago or some things. I woke up and it was hurting. Usually after a good night's sleep, it goes away. But I've slept good for like the past two or three nights and it has not gone away. And when I say sleep good, I don't mean like for eight hours or like dreamed a million dreams or like felt really good. I just mean I have my normal regular sleep. So I'm just really annoyed. I think I'm going to go to my parents' house and get in the jacuzzi and try to release some of the tension with the heat. Um, I need to call and text my mom and ask her if she's willing to watch Jasmine while I get in the tub and kind of hang out for about an hour or two, or if she wants me to bring all the kids or no kids. So that's kind of where I'm at. If I just take Jasmine, then that'll give me and Jazz some one-on-one -on -one time and her and Gigi some one-on-one -on -one time. But if I take all the kids, then Nick can get some rest without any interruption. So either way, it's a win-win. But if I leave and he's trying to sleep and the girls wake him up, then he's going to have to be dealing with them by himself. So it really just is what it is. Um, I was prepping this bottle for the girls because Raina started stirring and I figured I should get something prepped for Clementine. She's bound to wake up any minute. Clementine's sleeping on her stomach in the room and uh, Raina's on her back and Nick is sleeping too. Um, Jazz just woke up and I went to give her her tablet and I realized I left it in her room last night so it's not even charged. So I decided I'm going to put her tablet on the charger and then put her in the playroom, get her set up with paint and clean up in there a little bit so that there's nothing dangerous um, while she's in there. And I also have a camera in there, the baby monitor, so I'll be watching her while I'm enjoying Sex in the City in my room. Um, I'm very excited because I'm almost done with Sex in the City and then I'm going to start um, and just like that, which is Sex and the City 2. And then I read that there's a Sex and the City 3 that's still going right now, which I'm excited about because I want to see how these journeys have evolved. And Girls is the 20 year old girl's version, um, 20 year old white girl's version of uh, Sex and the City. And Insecure is the black girl version, black girl pushing 30 year old version of just how a woman navigates her life or whatever. Obviously, I don't know any other versions. I haven't expanded that much um, yet, but that's what I've discovered so far obviously just based on the main ensemble but anyways come along with me to watch my journey in cleaning the garage look at the little sleepy baby they're fussing they're moving waking up it's a live baby wake up I need a burp right now. She just had two ounces. You hungry, Clembo? Bitch. Raina's like, one moment, sir. I'm waking. Stretch. <laughs> she looks like a fish. What are you little fish? She looks like me when she's waking up, because that's how I stretch. Let me cut the camera short so I'm crying in y'all's faces. Either way, we gotta clean the garage, so let's go. The garage is obviously closed up, but it's the playroom slash the man cave. And there's my camera to keep an eye on things. Shout out to Marina for getting me the baby monitor. Everything is going to get done now. This is Nick's stuff from when he was cleaning his gun, so I need to kind of tidy it up, get rid of these open liquids, pick some stuff up off the floor, and then make this a painting area and put on a learning show for Jasmine.
Now that I have the paint area all set up, everybody's still sleeping in the bedroom, I'm gonna get Jasmine's TV set up. Well, it's Nick's man cave um, TV, but it'll be background noise while Jasmine paints and stuff, or if she wants to come sit here in the chair and watch, that is totally fine. She loves Paw Patrol, so I'll just start her off with um, that later. I kinda wanna have her doing something more to learning oriented. Okay, good, good, good. So we'll just start off here. And I gotta turn the volume up and get Jazz in here with breakfast. Putting away these dishes so that I can put the dishes I'm about to clean in the drying rack. I'm gonna get Jazz some juice and breakfast right after this. I like to hand wash the dishes. Nick prefers to throw them in the dishwasher. I feel like however you like to do the dishes, just do them that way. But personally, I think the dishes are more clean with the hand wash. Or maybe in the dishwasher with a high quality soap or something like that. But I feel like the dishwasher doesn't get intimate enough with the scrubbing. So when we level up in the future and have dishwashers that manually scrub, then maybe. But I don't know, my parents growing up, we had a dishwasher, but they said, we couldn't use it because we had to learn how to hand wash for years. So now it's just a habit, I guess. And it's quicker. It's quicker to hand wash for me, personally. I have so many leftovers from 4th of July. I need to figure out how to weave these leftovers into every single meal, you feel me? But I'm going to have myself some like brisket and beans and um, whatnot for brunch breakfast lunch because I haven't had breakfast so it'll be my first meal and then when Nick wakes up I'll probably make him like a brisket sandwich or something with pickles and onion because we have brisket leftovers maybe put some beans on the side for him but I do want to go to my parents house and get in the tub for my neck so it all just depends on what I hear back this water is getting nice and warm I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I rarely ever wash the bottom of cups and bowls. Cause I'm like, how'd it get dirty anyway, you know? Unless I see something on it specifically, I just wash the part that gets eaten out of. Peanut butter and jelly, can never go wrong with that. Creamy peanut butter today, crunchy peanut butter tomorrow. Nick prefers the crunchy peanut butter, I get them both. I just got this jam, because I ran out of jelly and jam. I'm about to let you out, chill. So I'm only doing one piece of bread, then I'm cutting it in half, and then I'm flipping it over so that it's a tiny, peanut butter and jelly sandwich and with hot dog on the side okay so I'm gonna cut up the hot dog and I'm also gonna heat jazz up this quesadilla and cut it in half so for breakfast right now it's a peanut butter and jelly half 
cut up hot dog slices, blueberries, hot, and a quesadilla with pepperoni and cheese in it. Hopefully she eats it all. I'm gonna put her in front of the TV with her food first and then show her the paint. Cause I really don't want her to um, paint on her food or play with her food or anything like that. So just gotta cut that sucker. It's got eggs in it too, pepperoni, cheese, and egg. Hot, hot. Okay, so got that there. Hot dogs in here. Piece of sandwich. Blueberries. A couple of blueberries and just kind of throw them on the plate as that little healthy option there and voila. Perfect, so Jasmine's breakfast is ready to go. Raina just started crying, so I gotta deal with that, but I'm gonna have Jasmine eat and sit and watch TV first, and then I'll show her that I set up her paint area to have a good time. She's gonna want me to paint with her, but I'm not gonna paint with her. I gotta go lay down. My back and my neck hurts. It never stops. I don't know if y'all can hear jazz in the background. <sighs> but now I gotta go get her set up. Oh, I need to turn up the TV in here first. <sighs> we keep the remotes in the bedroom. The letter? Wow, thank you for spelling out those words with wow. me. Yeah, it looks really good so far. Jazz and I are on our way to go see my mom. Um, I have a crick in my neck, so I'm gonna get in the jacuzzi. And Jasmine's gonna hang with mom for a bit and have some one-on-one -on -one time. Hope y'all are having a great day. I'm just enjoying my little soak here. Um, my dad found some old home movies that I've been asking him to look for because I'm the youngest in my family, so I have the least memory. So I'm gonna watch those next. I'm really excited about it. I'm gonna go downstairs and check in and see if you can help me set it up because he's in the pool with Jasmine and my mom. Saturdays in my parents' house. <laughs> Oh my, you did so bad. <laughs> 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 